Hey guys, what is up besides Bitcoin? Hope you're doing good. I just wanted to give you guys an update on what I'm doing, what trades I'm taking, where I'm at with my trading journey. So first up with Bitcoin. Um, I took a trade yesterday when I saw it um, starting to do a bullish engulfing. Um, so what I based that on was a thing called bullish divergence. So you can see this line here is actually angled down a little bit, whereas the RSI is angled up. So to me, that is a very bullish sign first up when I saw that. And then I also saw, you know, the middle candle, the skinny hammer, bull hammer. And also I saw when it went past the 50, fibs the 50 weekly fibs i just saw that as three confirmations to get in on a trade because i love trading morning star reversals um, and it's probably a bit risky for some to get in at that point but to me i reckon that was a risk worth taking i got in here as you can see i'm currently still in this trade i haven't closed it because what I'm seeing is that it broke through the previous um, trend line support and now it's retesting it. But I think that it is just retesting, which is what it always does um, after, you know, a big bull candle and then it shoots back up again. So I'm not getting out of my trade. I'm keeping it open. You can see it here. That's where I got in. I actually got in down here, but I added a little bit more. So that's why that line moved up. But I think it's going to come back to retest the 20.236 fibs. And then you see this trend line here. I think it's just going to retest that and then continue going back up. So now is actually a good time once it retraces to get in a trade, although this is not financial advice, but um if i wasn't in already i'd get back in when it retests this possibly even back down to here it might retest but i don't think so i think this is looking like strong support level so that's where i'm at with btc um i will scroll up so you can see that i'm in profit at the moment there you go um I'm also in an ETH trade, however, I didn't really get an ideal entry in that one. Um, you can see it's today it's it's red again, and I got in not the best spot. I think it's coming back down to retest this um, trend line, but it's still a higher low. The higher low confirms new market structure. So I think it's going to turn around and continue going up. I'm confident and I'm keeping my trades open because of that. So that's where I'm at with my trading. Two trades on today. I did close my other ones that I did in my last video, my BTC one and my ADA one at a loss. So just to be fully transparent, it wasn't that much of a loss. I was prepared to lose that. Um, yeah. The trick is to get, you know, the ones that you do get right to get a nice return on those and the losses that you make, try not to get so many, but they're just like a small loss, like one to 2% of your account. Um, yeah, but you know, we can't always get it right. So just to be realistic, but when you do get it right, and especially in the Morningstar reversal trades are always... A winner for me they're good those turn out to be really good trades for me um, you can see I got in on this one here on BTC that was another morning star reversal and I wrote it all the way up to here it was probably one of my best trades um, so far because that's like 20% I think it was a hundred percent gain at 5x leverage and the risk to reward was 11.5, um, 11, yeah, it, it was one of my best trades so far. 
So hopefully this one will also turn out to be a nice huge win. Who knows? Um, always prepared to, if it suddenly busts through this line again, then I'll, I'll get out. But I don't think it will because there are fundamental reasons for Bitcoin to be going up right now. And I will show you the reasons why if you haven't been following crypto Twitter news. Um, basically, yeah, there's my chart that I posted on Twitter. If you want to stay up to date, I'd suggest following me on Twitter because that's where I post my charts and what trades I'm taking. Um, so yeah, I just posted, this is big news. Not only has El Salvador adopted Bitcoin as legal tender, they are now doing this. Um, so this guy has just instructed the president to put a plan up to offer facilities for Bitcoin mining with very cheap, 100% clean, 100% renewable, zero emissions energy from our volcanoes. This is going to evolve fast. And this is huge news using geothermal energy from volcanoes. I mean, that's huge. Yeah, so I love being on Twitter and following all the, the you know, chatter on there because it's always the, the latest news and it's great. It's a great place to, when you're, you know, in crypto to follow people on there and see what they're saying. But yeah, huge news. That's very, very bullish fundamentally um, for Bitcoin. So yeah, big, big news. Um, and another reason why, you know, if you missed if you missed that entry in your trade, then definitely the retracement. I reckon it's going to break out of this triangle. Um, but yeah, we're still waiting on like key levels for it to bust through as well. So to me, it would definitely be bullish once it hits uh, this top trend line, which is about fifty one. 51k or once it goes past the 23.6 fibs then I think we're in the clear but if it goes up but then goes back down again then it might be ranging for a bit more who knows so that to me is a critical key level that's why I put sell or buy there um, maybe it's just going to go up shoot up to here and then go back down again who knows but I have a feeling that it won't. I think that that is the bottom. Um, and this here is my buy zone on the weekly, which it has now hit many, many times. And the weekly trend line seems to be following that as well. So yeah, there you go. That's my analysis on the big two, king and queen. Um, if that was all a bit too full on for you, like you didn't understand all that terminology, then I do have an intro to crypto trading webinar you can watch below. It goes for 20 minutes and it's free to watch. Um, yeah, so you can understand more about trading and how to get in and just feel free to ask me any questions that you have. Um, I will do a video shortly on how you can earn interest on your cryptos higher than what's in Binance because I did do a video on that with earning interest in Binance but I found a wallet that actually pays you way way more interest than Binance and a really beautiful thing I found out by my mentor was saying that um, you can get a crypto loan out as well um, as long as you have you know the crypto enough crypto collateral you can get a loan out against crypto um, in that wallet. So this is actually amazing. Um, really, really amazing. It's, yeah, I'll get into it in my next video. Um, that is all for now. I can't think of anything else to say at the moment. Um, while I'm here, oh yeah, actually I do. I've got something up my sleeve, <laughs> something else. I couldn't help myself. I couldn't help creating a Bitcoin baby shirt because I am obviously a long time Bitcoin fan 
And so I decided I couldn't find any shirts that I liked. So I created my own Bitcoin baby shirts. Um, so yeah, there's female short sleeve, long sleeves, uh, in black and in white, um, or to suit black and white or dark and light backgrounds. Um, there you go. That's my design. If you, and also if you like them, if you, you can have them on hoodies, any color you like, sweatshirts, any color you like, men's tees. Um, yeah, if you want to actually own one of these, just message me and I'll, I haven't set up a shop as yet, but yeah, this is just something I did just for fun. Um, because, you know, to stick it to all the Bitcoin haters out there, but also for Bitcoin lovers, um, I just thought it was fun to create something like this. So yeah, if you want one of these, just let me know and, um, yeah, I can get one made for you and sent out to you. Yeah, so that is all for now. Cheers.